the, the film is wonderful, the cartoon, but what really kind of excited me was the idea of how do you put a stampede on the stage? You know, that, the challenge of doing something that is more logically cinema because of its scale and all those animals, and they're not cats, you know, they're big. But I knew that <clears throat> we had to do something in theater that film can't do, and that's about breaking that wall. So the idea of creating this extraordinary opening where all of the animals can progress down the aisles and you can fill the theater with birds on kites and you can, I knew that we, we should do something that only theater can do. And again, there was this freedom to come up with a concept. And I started to, as I said, I was interested in the stampede and I started to draw and and come up with these concepts of putting humans, we've now called them human animals. that's been a, a name, or a double event, which means that you're aware of the human, you're not trying to hide the human, but off their body might be a cheetah. And you see the manipulation. In traditional puppetry, the, the little hand puppets go, the, the puppeteer is down here and you just see these little puppets and you don't really see the rods and the strings and the manipulation. And here the concept was show it. Transparency. You're going to show the art of doing the puppet as well as the art of the story. That the enjoyment of this production will be how it's being uh, told, the story how it's being told as well as the story itself.